two family. Sorry to leave this note, but but I've made it. Finally found a girl, and we're gonna run away together tonight. I know you'll be confused, but I've had to keep this a secret. I'm gone now. I wish I wish I could have said goodbye properly, but it's just too risky. Well, I need at least seventy-five percent. Yeah. You know you can trust me, man. Alright. Yeah, don't worry about it. Okay. Cheers. Bye. Well? Well, you're gonna give us the money. Oh my god, I'm gonna be rich! Yep. What now? Same time, same place next week. Take to the courts. Can I come and ask a few questions, please? Yeah, okay. Um, what's this about? Well, I'm investigating a crime and sources have led me here to you two. Oh, and what sources are these then? That's confidential information. Oh, sir. confidential, is it? Yes. Alright, well, I'm going upstairs if you need me. his power. Am I a threat? We're no longer talking about the crime, are we, detective? Is, is that a problem? You should come back tomorrow, when he's in a better mood. I like it when it's like this. Why? I get to see you alone. So fed up with this phrase. It feels like every time you do a deal, we just, we just get closer to being caught. Come on, we can do this. Think of the wealth. Think of me. Some days, I just want to call it a day. No, I can't give up on this money. Do this for me. Alright, only because I love you. The following morning from our first meet, I. I couldn't describe my feelings for her. I had a serious case to solve, but I couldn't focus. I couldn't focus without thinking about her face, her, her perfume. It was so unprofessional of me, but I just had to see her alone. Last night's inquiry. Uh, come in. Thank you. Is your is your husband in? You just missed him. He's just gone to work. Oh well, it'll just be me and you then. If the conversation's like anything it was last night, then you can stop now. Why's that, and why? Too much to handle. Again, be careful what you're implying, detective. Call me Sam. Sorry, I just get just get carried away. You're such a beautiful woman, Miss Monteri. Rose. So, what do you want to know about this drug scandal? Drug scandal? I never mentioned any drug scandal. You've got yourself in a very vulnerable position now, don't I'm you? I'm sorry, Sam. I'm just in a terrible way at the moment. Why's that? My husband. He's horrible. I'm only with him for the money. When he dies, I inherit everything. Oh, Rose. It's, it's okay. No, it's not okay. You don't understand. I can't bear it. Can't you help? Help what? Get rid of him. No, I can't do that. I'd lose my job. Sam, please. It's my only option. Okay. Well, it would have to be quick, quiet and soon. Yes, that's perfect. What happens now? Around the corner, at four o'clock. Bring him with you. Okay. I can't thank you enough. You better leave now, or you look suspicious. I know, you're right, but we could be together when he's when he's gone. Thanks again, Sam. I'll see you then.
by now I can't believe what I got myself into. So, so that's it. That's why I'm running away. By the time you read this, he'll be dead and I'll be with my love. Don't judge me. I fell in love. So deep, I couldn't get out. I'm sorry, sir. This has to be done. Rose, the gun is empty. I'm sorry, detective. I emptied it. You see, we can't have you interrupting our drug operation. People like you make me sick. What? What do you mean? I never loved you. I just needed to get rid of you. 